Hello, great tens, and a warm welcome. My name is Mr. T, your host, and I'm delighted to be presenting to you video number two covering the concept of exponential equations. We move on to the first question, where we are required to solve for x having been given 2 to the power 3x minus 1 is equals to 0, 0.125. Notice immediately that we are given a decimal on the right-hand side. We need to convert that decimal into a fraction first. So if we do that correctly, we get 2 to the power 3x minus 1 is equals to 1 over 8. But the 1 over 8 needs to be written in its prime form, and that will be 2 to the power 3x minus 1 is equals to 1 over 2 to the power 3. Again, the 1 over 2 to the power 3 can be written as 2 to the power 3x minus 1 is equals to 2 to the power negative 3. Now that the bases are the same, we do away with the bases whilst we equate our exponents. We get 3x minus 1 is equals to negative 3. 3x is equivalent to negative 2. Therefore, my x value is equal to negative 2 over 3. We move on to the next question. Where we are given 1 over 8 to the power x is equal to 64. Applying the same concept of converting a fraction into its prime form, we're going to get 2 to the power negative 3, all that to the power x, and the 64 can be written as 2 to the power 6. Simplifying or removing the brackets on the left-hand side, we're going to get 2 to the power negative 3x is equal to 2 to the power 6. Doing away with the bases, we remain with negative 3x is equal to 6. Solving for x, we get our x value being equal to negative 2. We move on to the third and last question. We're given 9 to the power x plus 1 times 3 to the power 3 minus 4, all over 27 to the power x plus 1 is equal to 1 over 9. The idea of solving such an equation is that you need to fully simplify the left-hand side. You need to fully simplify the left-hand side by converting each base into its prime form, starting with the 9 to the power x plus 1, which can be written as 3 to the power 2x plus 2. The 3 to the power 3x minus 4 remains the same, but the 27 to the power x plus 1 should be written as 3 to the power 3x plus 3. And that should all be equal to the 1 over 9 can be written as 3 to the power negative 2. Simplifying the left-hand side by applying all the laws of exponents, Whenever we are multiplying bases that are the same, we add the powers. But also, whenever we are dividing bases that are the same, we subtract. We're going to have a long expression written as 3 to the power 2x plus 2 plus 3x minus 4 minus, in brackets, 3x plus 3 is equal to 3 to the power negative 2. Simplifying that expression, we're going to get... 3 to the power 5x minus 2 minus 3x minus 3 is equal to 3 to the power negative 2. Again, fully simplifying it, we get 3 to the power 2x minus 5 is equal to 3 to the power negative 2. Taking it to the other side, we're going to get 2x minus 5 is equal to minus 2. Then we get 2x is equal to 3, solving for x, we're going to get x is equal to 3 over 2. I hope you enjoyed that lesson. Keep watching. Signing out is Mr. T. Bye-bye.